moms welcome to another video and today I'm just gonna be I mean as you can see from my um, title I'm gonna be talking about I can't believe that I finally did it but I'm gonna be talking about yeah menstrual oh my gosh menstrual cup believe that I actually bought one finally I've been contemplating on getting one ever since I actually I wanted to get one ever since I heard about it but I'm just a little bit scared and so anyway I can't believe that I finally did it I bought myself a menstrual cup so I heard about this from my friend. I'm gonna put her link, um, her review of her cup um, in the description box below. But yeah, I, I heard about it from her and I've always, you know, I've been curious and I, I wanted to try it, but I just, it took me a while to finally buy myself one. So um, I'm just gonna show you what it looks like. Ah! I can't believe I'm gonna be putting this inside me but yeah obviously I'm not an expert so um, I'm gonna put the links that I that I um, watched to learn about more about this product um, it is my first time and I'm gonna show you in um, a clip after um, in another clip how I how that how the experience is and that before I show you that video I just want to talk to you about what I think um, you know what I think other households should also have in their house to sort of start a zero waste um, journey I don't know um, but yeah just just I think these are simple things um, obviously they are very simple and um, um, it might it might not look much but I think that if we do little things collectively they do um, you know they do amount to some things environment so first is obviously this has this is this has been fake uh, popular um, these are I'm just gonna show you these are yeah metal straws especially if you have kids like um, our family I have kids and they do enjoy um, drinking with a straw so there I have these and for the milk tea for our, us adults so um, and they do come with a cleaning brush so and I always have a set of these in my bag or in our diaper bag just in case we need it of course you can always do without um, a straw but just in case you are the type who wants to drink from a straw you have the metal straws here um, next would be of course echo bags <laughs> Um, it's very easy to have this. A lot of companies give this um, for free. It doesn't have to be a very nice echo bag like what I have here. But this is what I bring with me if I know that I'm gonna be buying stuff or I'm gonna be needing an extra bag just to eliminate having to um, get an, a, a plastic bag or, you know, because it is very, very convenient. To carry stuff with a plastic bag but if you bring yourself some sturdy echo bags then yeah I mean you eliminate having to get uh, or use a plastic bag and this one is a collapsible silicone <laughs> cup which I got actually for free um, yeah, someone just gave this to me a long time ago and it's just now that I'm beginning that I'm realizing how much it useful it is to have this one when I want to drink and there's free water in the restaurant or something so yeah and it has a 
cover here. And um, lastly is, my mom gave me this one. This is okay, so it's still wet because we are using it at home. It's a silicone, I think, silicone, silicone, silicone sponge for your dishes. My husband hates using this, but I kind of like it. Um, it does clean some um, uh, dishes properly than a sponge. Or, you know, you can still use the sponge, but have one of these just so you prolong the use of your sponges and then maybe don't you don't have to to replace it that often so yeah some of this some um, environment friendly stuff for you guys there so yeah finally finally i got myself this is the meluna i'm gonna show you in that clip the unboxing and what's inside and all that stuff um yeah let's go and do that <laughs> watch that so i recently finally purchased this meluna menstrual cup and i'm just so this is the box i'm just gonna show you um i got it from shopee it's around nine around one thousand and then plus shipping so around one thousand seventy pesos so this is this is the <laughs> large the large um classic classic um the luna cup in purple with a stem finally so um it comes with the uh, instruction manual there and then it has a pouch where you can store the this one yeah. And then I also got this one. It's a calendar, I think. Um, you can track your period. There. So, there. I'm just going to sterilize it, disinfect it. Um, of 
obviously I'm not an expert but I was I think that this is the what most women you, uh, do and what they find easier to put in so the punch 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 down I think this is the one punch down fold there so there I'm gonna put the okay, I'm just gonna do it again because I don't know if I'm doing it right um punch down I, I'm sorry about the background I'm in my obviously I'm in the bathroom so it is my first day I just got my period this afternoon so I'm gonna hold it in at the bottom at the base like this I think and then I'm gonna put the I'm just gonna show you I'm gonna put the lube here like I I saw on the and the on the videos here and at the back so let's just put okay a little bit and just spread it here and here there I hope this works oh, I'm so excited and a little bit nervous at the same time I don't know and then I'm gonna put my leg up and um, I'm gonna put my leg up and just insert this okay let's do this guys okay I got it in but I don't think it's really in there uh -huh. okay it's not yet open how do you open it I'm gonna pinch it a little bit. Um, okay. Um, okay. I'm gonna put a little bit of glue because I feel a little bit of friction. But um, it is inside. I think it has it has to be a little bit more in not yet open okay so there is a learning curve they say here it will take a few times to uh, I think it's not right guys okay. <laughs> not successful for the first time I have to do it again Attempt, attempt number two. I don't know what I'm doing wrong, but attempt number two. I cleaned it again. I washed it. And and I'm just gonna put. I'm gonna attempt to do this and just tell you about it after <laughs> because um, I'm being distracted. So I'm gonna try to put this on and uh, get back to you guys. Hey guys so I think I was able to put it in there and I think I was able to open it so I don't know but I did put a panty lighter just in case there's a leak and I did not put it properly but um, so far um, yeah <laughs> so far um, I think I don't feel anything I am afraid that I won't be able to find the stem to pull it out later but um, let's see because they said that it's never gonna get lost there you will be able to pull it out again so um, yeah so let's see later um, right now I don't feel anything like um, yeah I don't feel anything so it is a good thing. I hope I did put it properly and I I am I will need practice to put it on. So the first time I think that's why why I wasn't able to do it properly was because I think there was already blood coming out so it kind of made it more uh, slippery and then I panicked a little bit so um, so I did try it again and I 
but I think I was able to put it on. So let's see later um, before I sleep. Before I sleep, I'm gonna try to pull it out and check it and yeah, let's see what happens. So I checked it and um, there wasn't a leakage on my pads, on my pad, but um, there was blood around the cup, outside, around the cup. Um, I don't know if when I pulled it out, there was you know, blood coming out so it didn't catch it. But I think the cup didn't open, like open that mm, that uh, opened properly. It was a little, a little bit deformed. So I don't know. But I wore it for maybe one and one and a half hours, and there was blood in the cup, and uh, there was blood in the cup, but also outside. Uh, but nothing in my pad, so I don't know. Um, and then, you know, I inserted it again right now, and um, I think I can't tell if I open if it opened properly. Um, I feel like it didn't open again properly, but we'll see. I'm gonna sleep on it tomorrow. I'm gonna sleep, but yeah, that's that's my first experience with a menstrual cup. And hopefully by a few more cycles I'll be an expert there so yeah um, I do hope that you enjoyed this video or find it um, entertaining at least or uh, and of course I hope it was helpful for you especially if you are planning thinking of uh, using a menstrual cup um, it was my first time to put it in and um, yeah i need practice i i have i learned that it needs time to to uh learn how to insert and um put it uh, and pull it out so yeah um don't forget to subscribe to my channel and um do share this video give it a thumbs up if you like it comment down below if you want to know anything about what I uh, discussed and or um, if you have other stuff that you think we should um, have in our household to to help the environment to have a zero waste um, lifestyle there um, that's it uh, thank you for watching I'll see you in the next video bye